<sighs> I've been much since she. Let me get things started. And yeah. Going to hop onto the server, make a new base, and it's anyone. Of course he's on right now. Good god. That was gonna rob his base today, too. Uh, it, he might be AFK. I hope he's AFK. But you know, the, uh, there's a non zero chance that he checked to see when I'd next be on to make sure that he would be on. It wouldn't surprise me, but it's part of the villain playbook. You need to be somewhat predictable so things are fair. Hmm. Definitely guarding his stuff. Main thing is, I want to make sure he doesn't see when I go and make uh, a portal to a new dimension to make a new base. I do not need him seeing. The question is just whether he's going to be on right now. As in actively on, or just AFKing again. Ah, this is going to be interesting. Come on, come on. Well, another minute of waiting for the server to let me in, so let's have some noodles. Mm. Some leftover chicken in it this time, but I think I ate all the pieces already. Oh. Turns out, it's pretty good. Well, it's leftover chicken that I put in new soup. Is Dom on right now? That's the question. See, if he's not on, I could just waltz into his base and take his stuff. That might be the move. I think he's AFK. Maybe. Well, the big thing to do is check the map. He should be around here. And it. Uh, his base location is around this way. He doesn't show up there right now. I don't presume he's there right now. What do you mean, turns out? Well, what happens is that he's on right now. When I was gonna go try to raid his base. He's not there on the map. And I more or less know where it is, because I got close to it. Oh, well. Yeah, it turns out Dom is on right now. When I was hoping he would be at work or otherwise indisposed so I could go and raid his base. And I said there's a non-zero chance that he... Oh, they terraformed this. Oh, interesting. What kind of rock is this? Oh, it's Holy Stone from the Ether. Interesting. They didn't really light this up, though. And, oh, the little village they had built is just completely gone. I would lose. I'm not going to do that. I don't have enough resources to fight him. This is the only game he plays, and he plays it more than I play other games. Okay. But either way, his base is... Where am I again? Around here. Okay, so... Hi, how are you doing? I'm going to rob one of my friends. Presumably. Yeah, because... <sighs> Hello, how are you doing? That said, I don't know. He did not respond to me. I think he's just... AFKing. That means if I want to be really funny, I could actually... Maybe try to kill him. When he's in his base. In what way? In a good way or a bad way? College or something? He should be around here. And oh, there's the Dom base. He's got this funky looking penthouse kind of thing. I like that. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, hmm. Well. Cataclysm. Botania. So I'm wondering, where would be a non-obvious spot to put my sort of landing? Yeah, as long as you have fun at the end. So let's make Dom base. 
Teleport to that. Well, either way, make the most of the time you've got. Yeah, he's not here right now. Mount Dom. That's funny. White elevator. Move camouflage. Eh, interesting, so... Elevator mod. Ah, uh, interesting. As in... Okay. Mentally, financially, or... Oh, huh. Wondering how I get in here, then. I wonder if his security system is just this elevator not working. Or not really being usable from outside. It... <laughs> Let me see. Oh, but... Oh, well, we removed his camouflage. So he knows I've been here. Oh, interesting. So how Elevator mod. Huh. Elevator mod. Spiritual successor. Yeah, teleportation. Oh, sneaking! Okay, that's how that works. Try to jump. Jumping or sneaking. How do you camouflage that? Huh. Elevator camouflage. Well, he'll know we're here then. Arizona's. I did not know you were an Arizona iced tea person. Oh, for humanity. Uh huh. Okay, well. Time to rob his stuff. Okay. It's, he's not here right now. He's not on right now. What can I take? What can I take that he would actually miss? This. Just take the netherite backpack. It. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Let's do that. As in the place or just the food? Well, it. Okay. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna take his stuff. So, what can I take? Well, actually, I could put a lot of it in the backpack. No, I'm just robbing his base. I'm gonna take as much as I possibly can. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, uh, that's not awesome, but it's decent. It's friends to enemies. That's what it is. Repulsion runes. Let's see if and when he shows up. He's definitely not online right now. Okay, let's take his essence. Ooh, Insanium Essence. Let's just take all his essence. Oh, that's a crazy amount. Let's just take it all. Yeah. Let's see how much I can put in. wonder if he has any upgrades on his backpack right now. Maybe, I don't know. It's possible. Either way... He opened himself up to this. And he definitely doesn't know I know where his base is. Okay. Here's something moving. Let's see what happens. Hmm. But either way, taking this netherite backpack is quite nice. Just want to make sure he doesn't insta kill me. Yeah, taking all his essences, though, would be a nice idea. And eh, dirt essence won't do much. See what his essences are. Fire could be decent. Just the more we take, the more we impede him. Lost a crochet project? Lost. Oh, okay. Essences. This is nice. I like that. Vengeance essence. Fertilize. Ah, okay. Water, earth. Air. It's the mystical agriculture stuff he really wants right now. Oh, netherite essence, pig essence. In the end, it's... Ooh, essence of undeath. Check out his enchanted books. Got any... Oh, let's take every tombstone soulbound book he has. Incredible enchantment. Okay. Hmm. 
Any other things I'd like? Magic Siphon. Just to make sure he doesn't have it. Freeze enemy on hit. Skulk Smite. Blessing. Stable Footing. Shimmer. Longevity. Breaking. Normal Soul Bound. Okay. Thorn Skulk Smite. Hmm. Skull Enlightenment. Huh. That's decent. Oh, less spell resistance. See, mystical enlightenment. What was that one? Finchy is meh. Okay. Make sure I. Hmm. There's one. I need to find that mystic enlightenment book. Get right, right. Okay. And then. Scroll through or look through, look for anything that's particularly valuable. How many diamonds he's got? Let's take them all. And netherite. I I am. Congratulations. Nether war. Oh, blocks of netherite. Well, he denies it, but it's true. He. I wonder if he knows that I'm in here. Uh, what else is useful? May as well take the emeralds. But what does he need? What can we meaningfully impede? Hmm. Sapphire, uh. Inferium gemstone. Gemstones. Ah, we got other gemstones here too. Have fun! I'm enjoying robbing him for all he's worth. It is quite enjoyable. See how much I can take without griefing him. That's the big thing. He's not gonna stop me from stealing resources, it's just griefing is not allowed. Hmm. We could take these hearts, maybe. I. It'd be nice to get that honey. And then. Lapis, sure. Hmm. It's just there's a lot in here and. Hard to tell what specifically I don't want or need. For a second, I thought that was somebody. Hmm. What can I take that he would actually miss? White apple, obsidian, moonstone. Hmm. Ender surge. Let's just take those. Okay. Ah, the gems. Yeah. Second is gems. Got any flawless gems that I can take? Blood gem, blood spell power. Aww. Unique. Mm. Oh, unique is in can't be put in with any others. That's how that works. Flawed. Don't want to put anything other than flawless in. Thank you. Flawless ender surge. Flawless frozen. Mm. Flawless tyrannical. Ooh, that's good. Oh, Slipstream, Lunar, Lightning, Inferno, Illagers, Guardian, Protection, Solar, Holy, Mage Slayer. Hmm. What else is here? Oh, Gem Dust could be nice. Flawless Brawler's Gem, Dark Power Gem, and Dark Gem. We'll take those, sure. It's so funny how many things are just being given to me in terms of achievements just because I'm stealing things. I love it. Well, it's true. I'm doing my best to impede him. It... As, my, as his enemy, I can't make things easy for him. Never. Never, ever. Hmm. So I could take... His spawners, maybe? Just in case. Maybe. Infusion crystal, and does he have a... Supremium. Fusion. Inferium. Oh! They change colors as they go down. Interesting. Well, the easiest way would be... He doesn't have an insanium crystal. 
does he? Hmm. Best way would be to take the Insanium Crystal and turn it into crystal for ourselves. Rarity, material, maybe. You know, I'd like to think maybe that he's only left things behind that he can afford to lose. But frankly, I find that kind of hard to believe. Take his Uraninite. Hmm. Shurikane Bundle. Eventually he's going to find me. I mean, just the fact that the elevators have their stuff gone tells him what happened, but... Hmm. Any tomes? Tome. I'll take the Unbreaking, sure. Just to be sure about that. Hmm. Astrodux. A bezoir. It's... It's hard to see. It's really useful here. It'd be funny. I'd just teleport back home. It's that simple. Giant sword. That's funny. Pulling water from the reliquary. Hmm. Oh, ingots. Just take all the ingots. Hmm. What would be... Crimson iron would be nice. Could I take that he would actually miss? Yeah, we may as well just take all of these if possible. Radium ingot. Hmm. It's things that are sort of big, but not crazy. Hmm. Silver. Take your brass to see what happens. Come on. So what else is in this storage system that I'd be willing to lose? Oh, that's right. The easiest way to do this would be to find his discs themselves and take the discs. Crafter. So where is the actual... Where are the discs? <laughs> yeah, because that's right. I should just take his discs. Wherever they are. Hmm. Instead of going through all this song and dance. Yeah. Somehow I get the impression that it's hidden somehow. It would make sense. Oh, so it's just made a number of levels connected. Oh, interesting. And this... Let's take these capsules. <laughs> just for fun. Experience capsule. I'd be able to make use of those. Oh, growth accelerators. Nice. That'd be useful. Put a decent amount of them down. We can get our own setup going soon. An enchanter, a tinkering table, a sink. Ah, oh, I think that's just better water storage. And this crafting grid. Oh, it's got access to the stuff he had in there before. Yeah, because it's got the same stuff there. My question is just, where are his discs? Oh, right. Okay. <laughs> we took literally all of his things. <laughs> okay. All right. That's Dom's inventory. <laughs> it was that easy. All right, then. All right. I don't know how I feel about that. All I have to do is find his dis. Can I just check that out? Oh, but I should probably try to camouflage that again. Just in case. Mount Dom. Okay. Yeah, because it's just sort of... What did he use to actually get that camouflage effect? And if so... Hmm? I really do wonder where he is. Where he went. White elevator. That's with... 
City and Brick. City and... Hmm. Well, alright. City and... Well, it's because I had a hot coordinates. Camouflage gun? Camouflage applicator. Mm, okay. Remove camouflageable blocks to be highlighted. Play or remove camo. Crit appearance. Interesting. There was probably a camouflage applicator in that disc then. Okay. Let's just check and reapply the camouflage just to see. A whole's fair in love and war. We didn't break a single block. Okay. Let me see, is there a camouflage applicator in there now? There is no camouflage applicator in there. Huh. I... How do I make that thing then? With... Blackboard Blue. Huh. Pneumaticraft. It... It's fun. Takes some trouble sometimes, maybe. Pressure tube. Is there a pressure tube in there? Yeah, any air canisters? Just pressure tube. Compressed iron, pressure tube. Take those out, get some redstone. Yeah, exactly. I followed his exact words. Exact words. Hmm. Weber, air canister. Blue dye. Ebony, we have one blue dye in there. Thank you, Dom. No lever. Yep, we can take a lever out. Yep, exactly. He's got the proof. There's nothing. He can see this video and watch me do it. But. <laughs> is that gonna stop me? It definitely did not stop me. All he had to do was hide that behind something breakable. If I were in his position, what I would have done was put the disc behind a single block of glass. It's like, it's like with a vampire. I wouldn't be able to do anything else. I'd just have to turn away and say, oh well, can't break that block. Hmm. So for Pneumaticraft, it would have been smart. He didn't do that, though. Camouflage Applicator Smooth Stone. Huh, is there grid? Let's see. Right click to record any camouflageable and sneak right click. Let me see. When held nearby camouflageable blocks will be highlighted. Right, it was called Mount Dom. That's right. Hmm. You know, if you want, you can try to find me. He won't. So... No, that's white elevator. Huh. So I guess I'm gonna need to find an actual or make that chiseled obsidian myself. That's kind of sad. That does not go down any further. Yeah, well, we, <laughs> we took all his stuff. It's kind of sad. That, yep, just his growth accelerators. All his essence from his pylons. You know, he can work his way back up eventually, but for now, for now, that's going to be a bit of a problem for him. Hmm. So, obsidian. Kind of chiseled obsidian. Chiseled obsidian bricks. Obsidian brick slab. Obsidian bricks. That's simple enough to make. Let's copy one. Yeah, exactly. It's all about it's all about me and my grudge. Not really a grudge, just my complicated feelings. That way. Oh, okay. Obsidian bricks, and it's chiseled obsidian bricks. Now we got it. Figure out the camo gun. 
Maybe. I'm the Joker. So, let's undo the silly mistake we made, presumably. And just, I might need to find a way to pressurize this. Mm -hmm. Camouflageable. Apply remove. Wait, so how did he camo that? Camouflage. Huh? Wait. Well, I don't know how he did that then. Interesting. Let me just see then. Later mod. Camouflage. Right click with blocks. Right click with blocks to camouflage them. Okay, that's how that works. Simple enough. Let's just break this then. Yeah. Take this back. Re camouflage his stuff. Change this name to Mount Dom. Well. That, okay, didn't quite work then. But his coordinates are not the ones I'm attempting to hide. Hmm, go to Mount Dom. And, yeah, camouflage that thing. But I wonder, I might need to make more of those blocks to do that. Well, you know, it's not like I lost much by creating that camouflage applicator. That. Uh huh, there we go, cool. Now it's just camouflaged again. So, on innate inspection, it's not gonna tell them much. It's just. Why is there nothing in my crafting grid? Why is there. Why can't I access that? Oh, it's because I stole all your stuff. Or most of your stuff. <laughs> Alright. We're having fun. Go back to the house. I don't think... Well, we'll see how he reacts. It's gonna be interesting. Big thing is... I can make... Oh, he's not even in this dimension right now. Interesting. Hmm. wonder if he's in that... Nether portal then. Okay. Yeah, it's just... We robbed him. <laughs> we definitely robbed him. Uh, so what's in here? Porous flesh in a visceral heap. Oh my goodness, that's disgusting. Can't believe they have Kaled. Okay, well. At least this is mostly stuff. Flesh tendon strand. Some SCP type stuff. Huh. Well, it. I don't presume he's in here, actually. Question is where he is then. He might be in an RF tools dimension or something. I don't know. Oh, but... Interesting... Wait... Have I been here before, or... Is this what he's seen? It might be. Because if those are red nether bricks, and yeah, it's showing... Just generated chunks in general... Rather than... Wait, no, have I? I think I've actually been here. Well, it would make sense, considering that... The nether is severely compressed compared to other things there. Yeah, yeah, that's my stuff. This must be where I went into the nether from Rihanna's portal. Hmm. Well, okay. Nether bees. Hmm. Some basalt and bedrock. Why is it showing the ceiling? It's lined with silt for some reason. But it... I did not know that... 
Oh goodness, Biomes of Plenty added a literal flesh wasteland to the nether. Well, that's alright. Main thing to do is to... Oh, get into Lost Cities now and move all my stuff over. It really is just... I don't imagine Dom is going to be happy about this development, but I'm also not sure what he can really meaningfully do about it. <laughs> There's nothing that violated any of the rules that he set for me of my conduct. He can. He can definitely yell at me. But he... He did not secure his storage system enough. And he said there was going to be some way to make the security system inaccessible to other players, but that very plainly did not materialize. And with that alone, that dis in addition just giving us all of his resources, we quadruple our total storage capacity. And as a result, went from having full storage to half full storage. I... how many spirit orbs are in here? A decent amount. Okay. Take those out, see if I can max out that stamina. And... there we go! We have no need for any spirit orbs now. We have completely made use of them. So... anything else you can do with them? There is nothing else you can do with them, they're just trash now. Alright. So the next thing to do is going to be to go to... Oh right, we should put the stuff we took back in those chests. I mean, back in the storage system. Now that I can do that without really having any issues. I can make a better infusion crystal, among other things. My question is... Oh, and he's got a bunch of backpacks in here too. So in that netherite backpack, okay, there are no upgrades, because presumably it was the one he was actively using. But either way, it's ours now. It's funny how these things work, you know? Lots of fun, too. How many source... Yep, he hasn't done anything ours nouveau, so it's not like he is source. Okay, but it's... I, I really did do him dirty. That's undeniable. But... <laughs> What did he expect? He had his stuff there. He didn't put it on the lockdown. I, I think he genuinely... Yeah, he genuinely did not know that I knew where his base was. So he figured, okay, I can wait to figure out a security system, but actually he couldn't. <laughs> actually he couldn't. I feel like I should do some sort of tornado type... Tornado cache type thing where... Well, at this point, it's all mixed together in my storage system, so it'd be kind of hard to figure out what stuff is specifically his and what stuff is specifically mine. It's just all mine now. Well, it... He just didn't think I knew where his stuff was. He figured that he had more time than he actually did. Poor him, really. But, you know, it... Finders Keepers. How much else? Let's just see. Yeah, I put everything in the system. Alright. No, I could just take. There's more I could take, too. It. When I want to hurt someone, I can pretty adequately hurt people. I wouldn't say I'm proud of that fact, but we'd see some interesting and entertaining things happening. So, the only thing left are these growth accelerators and experience tanks. Experience capsules. Okay. So that's another quest complete. Number of quests complete. I... oh, are there... There are no nether stars in here. Interesting. Honestly, I guess I could just... well, I put the ones in Jack's storage in Rihanna's base. That's the thing. 
But it... I wonder if this is really just a volley in the war between us. Because he can definitely recover. If he knows what he's doing, he can definitely recover. But it's just a sort of... Oh, there are more things I could take from him. I might. It... It was already it was a gambit already to steal anything from him. It was even more of a gambit to take his storage guard. Ouch. But I think there are other controllers around. It We didn't take this. I'm gonna leave him with these. My question is, is there anything in this backpack? There's nothing in that backpack. Okay. It was there. So what I do know is that there was some network receiver crafter owned by... Oh, because... Well, it says owned, but it's not keeping me from taking the stuff. That... It's kind of silly. Crafter, crafter. Yet... Yeah. Or if tools utility... But it didn't stop me. He wasn't able to figure out a way to prevent me from just taking all his stuff. It... Oh, and... Oh, a creeper spawned there. It's kind of funny. You know what? Let's kill that thing. Just for fun. Oh, and look. One more tiny bit of essence. Oh, and also bamboo. So... So there is more I could take. There is more I could take, and... It's so funny that this place is incompletely lit up. It's got this purple obsidian lantern, but... And is that Enderman going to be anywhere near me, or... Crafters... So he's just making... What is he trying to make? Oh, various things using the essences. Metallurgic infuser. Soul extractor. Hmm. Diamond furnace controller. We could just take that out. Just steal his network card. <laughs> it would... I'm not sure I'd do it. It would really just be adding insult to injury. Well, we could... <laughs> we could take the blocks of coal for his furnator. We could also take... The network card. It... Yeah, let's just get rid of his power. <laughs> make him go mining again. How much longer is this going to go, though? Oh, it's got a lot stored, is the thing. Generates. Wait. So where is this starting, then? It's energizing orb. I did not mean to put the beef in there. Energizing rod. Where's this all coming from? Item pipe leads to... Oh, it's just putting it all in the same storage system. Except for, is this different? No, that just goes up to that crafter. Okay. Aw. Huh. Well, keep trying to kill that Enderman, I guess. A couple times. Depends on where it teleported to. And anything in this drawer? Nothing in that drawer. So it's really just a matter of... Eventually his stuff will tick down. <laughs> eventually it'll just run out of power. I guess we could... Wait... Something with blocks of coal. You know... Take his coal. Oh, wow. I am sorry to hear about that. Fertilized essence. This is good stuff. I could take that. Just empty him out, make sure he has no power. Make the guy go mining again. This is all for Inferium Essences. Okay. Crafter and... Lots of Essences, but... I'm gonna take the Fertilizer. That's mostly it. Hmm. Hmm. It's a... Sometimes a drop chance. And you know what? Let's take his Tiny Coal, too. Make sure that he has literally no way to power up his system. 
But it's... <sighs> no, it's taking down, but it's taking time. I wonder if there would be a way to just... Kill the power. Maybe. Either way, if I'm in the area, I'll just die relatively soon. Hmm. He'll get some coal essence, but... That should deal him a pretty sizable blow. Maybe. So up top, we just take all the coal. Every bit of coal. Yeah, yeah. We even took that network card, which was... Honestly, just mean. But... Oh, when he does have... Is that the environmental... Yeah, he does have an environmental accumulator. He found one on his own. He didn't need one from me. I... I really do just wonder. What is he going to do about this? <laughs> he doesn't know where I am. Well, what kind of threats can he meaningfully make on my person? And yeah, that is... Dying. Okay. Oh, what... What I could do is take all the hose out of his pylon. <laughs> that would be pretty vile. Means that it's going to stop harvesting. Yeah, yeah. You know, why not? Let's just take everything from him. It's... I feel like I'm going to end up giving this stuff back eventually, but just in the interest of fair play, but I feel like I could extract some kind of concession. He's just made a bunch of diamond hose to run these pylons. Oh, but is there a pylon underneath here, or how is that getting mined? Or is it? Yeah, it... Hello, hi. Okay. Let's just go home. There we go. <laughs> so he found me! After I took every single thing from him. So he knows it's me. <laughs> that... It's actually the best part. <laughs> he knows what was done. <laughs> I mean, he would have known anyway, but... It's really just... What does he do now? What does he do now? I presume he's gonna hop and call and just... Go off on me sooner or later. It's bound to happen. Okay. You got a problem, buddy? Well, suffice it to say I knew where your base was. What'd you do? Took everything? From what? Everything? <laughs> I'm open to negotiations. I feel like a productive deal could be set up that would benefit the both of us. What do you have in mind? I don't know. Giving you back your stuff on some sort of time-based installment plan. I was... How'd uh, you teleport out? Why would I tell you? We're gonna see what happens. We're gonna see what happens here. But... I want to tell you, I didn't break a single block. No, I know. Yeah. I intend on operating with as much liberty as I have within the rules set out for me. And that I did. Well, 
Things are interesting now. Why would... What kind of plan do you have in mind for me to get my stuff back? I feel like... You would have to do some sort of humiliating dance. Write some poem extolling my virtues. Something sufficiently humiliating. Something representing absolute defeat. Well, I need all my shit back, so think of it fast. Okay. Maybe, maybe I'll send you on a treasure hunt. To do what? To find your storage card. Is that all you took? Just my storage card? Well, not just that. You've still got all your mystical agriculture infrastructure up and running. Yeah, but none of the sh no. Well, first off, you took all of my coal blocks, so my system's about to die. And because you were here so often, so much, and didn't replace the hose, or maybe you took all the hose. I took all the hose. I should have put a lock in my system. Yeah, I, the entire time I was just thinking. If he had just put a single block of glass or something in front of his computer, I wouldn't have been able to do a damn thing. However. I kind of feel like a dog who caught the car. You know what I mean? I have absolutely no idea what you mean. Well, it's just sort of... Trying to figure out exactly what I'm going to do next, especially since you're watching me right now. Mm. Yeah. Good thing I don't know where you are. Yeah. But... There's no such thing as an excess of caution, suffice it to say. I have my plans and you have yours, presumably. It would honestly be within your... Oh, hello. Oh, that was smart. Interesting. Oh, oh, did he just use operator powers? What are you talking about? As in teleporting straight to me? No. You uh, would have not gotten a chat message too, by the way. Oh, was it related to that? Was it related to that network card? I don't feel like I have to give you an answer. Yeah, but I feel like Let's that's just say probably the I answer. I know where you live. Okay. And I can promise you that it had nothing to do with abuse of power. Okay. Fair enough. Just say I have my ways. Oh, you took all my hose too, didn't you? More or less. Did you, you take anything of mine and put it into your storage system? 
I... Because you can save yourself a lot of pain and suffering right now. My storage I system was completely it. full, which means that you have a good degree of my stuff now, too. Where were... So did you just dump my hose back into my... Thing? Storage card? Yes. Alright, well, no harm, no foul. Hmm. Oh, well. Well... That means that pretty much all of my stuff is gone now. Or at least a lot of it. How about this? If you do a humiliating dance, I can get you your stuff in no time. No, I think I'll find another way to steal it back. After all, we know where each other live now. I'm just waiting for you to move. That's the only reason I didn't want to pull that out, but you stole all my shit and I have a lot of stuff to do, so... What do you mean, waiting for me to move? As in, move out of my house? No, I just figure that now that you know that I know where you live, or at least have a means to get to you... Yeah. Bye. Get out. <laughs> Where'd you even go? I see. But what could I do to get the information on how you found me? That's the real question. You really want to? Yeah. Actually, no, I'm not going to give you in. I decided against it. Okay. You can sit and wonder um, all you want. But the only thing I can promise you is that I did not cheat. Meaning I did not use mod powers to teleport to you. I didn't use, like, some sort of log in the server to find out, like, your last coordinates where you logged off or anything. Because I don't even know if I can do that. I found it purely through natural means. Was it backpack related in some way? I'm not really equipped to answer any of your questions. Okay, well. Look, if you want to play hardball, we're going to play hardball. Well, of course. But part of playing hardball is trying to figure out a way around the other guy's balls. Is that how you just, is that by just straight up asking him? It can be. A win's a win. I think for now, I'm just going to stay around here and keep annoying you. Works fine for me. <clears throat> I mean, go ahead, keep shooting at me. It won't do much for either of us. But I would presume that taking that storage card was an unwise decision on its face. Oh, really? Well, because the only thing I can think of is that there was some item that you possessed in that storage system that allowed you to track me that I simply did not have knowledge of. That's a good conjecture. Okay. Well, 
If I can't take anything you have without you being able to track me, I'll figure out another way to cause you problems. Are you invisible? No. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. <laughs> I'm honestly just surprised you didn't have anything stronger than a diamond sword. That's not what I've been working on yet. Yeah, and? That's what I do. I mean, I have some blood weapon. But honestly, evil craft is not that good. Well, of course it's I mean, not good. It's cool. evil. The brooms are cool. But, like, there's not really much in the way of, like, offensive stuff. Mm. Well, I know where you are now, and you know where I am now, so... Somehow... Maybe I should just give you all my stuff before moving. Completely start over. See, this is what I was afraid was gonna happen. What? I reveal my- I- I-, I reveal that I know your location. To get my stuff back. And then you're just like, alright, well I'm gonna move because I don't have anything on me anyways. Yeah. I already planned on moving. There's no point in staying in the same place if you're just going to get found out and have your stuff taken. I mean, and I shot first, so now it's sooner or later that you take the nothing that I have. Figure out some way to lock down your stuff. You know what's funny? I don't even know what you would have had that I didn't already have, unless it's, like, specific to Ars Nouveau, or... Nothing! Uh, dude! But if you blew me, if you took all my stuff, then starting again would have been a bit of a tall order. I don't have any of your stuff. Well, you can. If you, you know where I am, and you can just take my diss anytime you feel. Chicken, huh? Well, it's interesting. I was Go just ahead, come down here. Go ahead, come down here. Oh. Okay. Oh wait, you can't. Oh, oh my bad. Oh, I, I, I'm sorry. I forgot. You can't come down here. Okay. Go ahead, rob me for everything else I have. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I figured as much. Hi, Hi, just go ahead and kill me. Oh, damn. What have you got? Some sort of regen? Maybe. I mean, if you're gonna... You know what? You know what? <laughs> there you go! Move out! Move out, bitch! I'm just destroying it all. You can have it all. No, I don't want it. Go ahead, take these source jars too. No, I don't need them. No, you can have them. I have nothing now. I've completely given up. <laughs> Enjoy being the only player on the server. Well, so he didn't like it. He didn't like it. Yeah. He didn't like being the evil guy, I guess, then. Well, there was nothing to do. That's a damn shame. Yeah, I guess so. Wow. Coward. 
Yeah? Well, there's nothing I can do at this point. You have literally all of my things, and unlike you, I have no infrastructure to get anything back. I was gonna give them back to you. No, you weren't. I just wanted to see you die. No, that's not true. Okay. Well, here's the thing. I'm gonna take... You can take everything. Oh, wow. I don't need anything anymore. It's all yours. So are you gonna quit the server? Probably. I've got other things to play. No way, bro! No way is... These are the consequences of, of your action mission. Yeah, you're right. It's all yours now. Well, I'm not going to play anymore. Yeah. Oh, a tuned diamond. That's an interesting thing. There's your progress for the Mahosukai mod. There's a bit of Ars Nouveau stuff if you want it, too. It's pretty useful. I'd recommend it. Where's your controller? Right next to my other stuff. Here. Take these backpacks, too. I don't want any of this shit, dude. Well, it's yours now. It's your problem. There you go. No. No. Oh, you got an Inferium just with you? Good There you go, you've got some stuff for iron sp Oh, that's right, right. You don't have any spells right now because I didn't take the spell book off. Check this out real quick. Artificers came. Let's see. Here. That's my spell book. Awesome. Rice cooker is a sick. Please try not to die. I think that it is it. There you go, bud. Mm. Oh my. Oh, I don't even have the bunny slippers anymore. Okay. That means I have to deal with full damage again. Be okay. Well, since I don't have my bunny slippers, it's a lot more complicated for me to get down. I'm not trying to kill you. There we go. Leave my land! Leave my land! This is my land! I'm not trying to take any of your stuff. I'm trying to give you the remaining things I have that you won't take from me. I don't want them. Well, I don't want them either. Put them in your chest. At no. Your no. It's yours Why? now. I don't want it. Well, neither do I. It's your responsibility now. Why, do, why don't you want it? What is all this garbage? It's garbage. It's your trash now. Enjoy the trash. Dude, this is actually annoying me more than you stealing my stuff. Okay. Whatever works.
here. Okay. Can I break that? Yeah, I can break that charger. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Let's get rid of, get rid of all this. That in the backpack. Okay. Okay. Oh, I do want your flesh. I will keep one of them. Okay. Is this ruined netherite helmet of iron yours? Not anymore. reason not for you to have taken that spell book, frankly. That was free progress that you just missed out on. I just didn't want it. Well, it's better than having to craft the tier one spellbook first. Wait, I don't have your spellbook on me, but I've got these spells on the left. Those are iron spells and spellbooks things. It's different. How do we get rid of that? Well, you have to. You unequip the spellbook. As in, oh, it's not it, my Ars oh, Nouveau. It, not the Ars Nouveau. It's the iron spells and spellbook spellbook. Auto equipped. Yeah. My diamond hoes aren't in here. They're in that storage card. The other one? It... No, your storage card. They're not. Well, then they might be in one of the backpacks. Maybe.
I dropped your backpacks off back with you. Yeah. Well, some of them. Yeah, some of the hoes are in there. Give me a second. Just see. Let's flood this cave. You know, it's a shame that I can't undo Spirit Orb health enhancements. Why is that a shame? Well, because I have them right now. Why are you doing this? To start over from square one. But it's all self-imposed. Yes. That makes for a very not interesting story. <laughs> yeah, it, it depends. You bit you, you you tried to bite you you, tr you tried you know fucking pulling pranks and stealing my items and it didn't work and you didn't, and you didn't like when I retaliated so now you're giving up and well quit. you weren't go I have no way to ensure that you were ever going to give those discs back and I'm okay. glad to believe you weren't I mean I legitimately was but you not know, anymore then. Even besides then, that doesn't mean that you just destroy your own entire base. Not necessarily. You could it's an option. Keep, you could try and come back and wrest it from me. It that was not going to happen. I don't have the resources for that. Okay, then we could have can't come up with some sort of deal. Notice how when you said notice how when you stole all thirty two thousand of my items I didn't immediately, um, no, where's my blood throwing there? Um, I didn't immediately destroy my entire base and be like, well, he's not going to give him back. Well, the difference is that you also had a lot of infrastructure to bounce back. Well, how so? Well, I because I, I couldn't, I couldn't break anything and all you had to do was... Like I said, keep your storage somewhere not immediately accessible to people without breaking blocks. That's not something I have going on. That does, you're trying to justify obliterating your entire base. Yeah. It's not gonna happen. There's no justification for it. It. We, we have different mindsets, that's all. Agree to disagree. Like, why, why are you resetting your entire progress o on your own? It's not like everything was taken away from you and you have to come back. You have to rebuild from scratch. It's the principle of the thing. You're doing it. There is no principle. You just decided, I don't, uh, I lost, so I'm going to just blow up everything and do all the hard parts again. Yeah. All right, whatever. Your stuff is sitting on a chest at the top of my base. Okay. If you want it. If. But it's gonna stay there. Okay. So, come and take it if you please. Or if you want. Okay. took my network transmitter. It should be in one of those backpacks or something. Or in the storage cart itself. What that does confirm to me is that the network transmitter itself can't have been how you found me. 
Maybe. I don't know. Main thing is, is that if I ever want to make sure that nobody ever finds me, I can never actually interact with anyone in any meaningful sense. Which makes a good deal of sense, but it's still a little disappointing. True. What? True. Yeah. And I you mean... you don't want people to find you, you can't interact with them at all, which makes for very boring villainy. Well, because what is villainy if you can't interact with anybody else? Well, it's defeat. Unless it, unless it means, unless it means that you have to um, do the entire game by yourself, and then only come back when you're ultra powerful and eviscerate everything. Well, it wasn't kill everyone. It was. Cause inter try to cause interesting problems. That was the idea, at least, but... Oh, well. You can still try and cause interesting problems. That just means yeah. that you can't do it when... There are, you know, other people... Or you can't do it directly to me. Yeah. But nobody else plays the game besides Jack, anyway. So... Corinne and Jack and her boyfriend do. Yeah, but they haven't been on in ages, and also... Th there's only so mean I'd be willing to be to someone whose real-world relationship is tied into the game. There are not that many acceptable targets right now. And that so, go you don't have to be a villain. You can just play the game with us. Yeah, but we will be more than welcome, welcoming. Uh. I mean, because look what being a villain has done. Yeah. Right. Separated you from everybody else, and then it didn't even matter in the end because you blew it all up. And I lost all my stuff. But that you chose to lose all your stuff. You didn't lose it. You threw it away. I literally had no way to guarantee that you would ever give any of that back. I never had any guarantee that you were going to give any of my stuff back. Oh, That's sure, but I again, the difference is that... To be totally honest, you would have lost a lot less in that situation, because like I said, all you no, had I to do is... I 32,000 items. Yes. 32,000. And you also had a very good mystical mind. agriculture setup. You could have just mined a single chunk of coal and gotten everything going again. No, I couldn't have, because... I mean, sure, I would be growing Inferium and stuff, but there are some irreplaceable things in in my storage. Also, like, 85 Insanium. Like, oh, I guess I could start over. No. I don't want to. I want to get my storage back. And so what I I'll, would rather find you and take it from. Okay. That doesn't mean that I'm gonna. I'm not gonna just give. I'm not just, just gonna lie down. Fair. Um. Now, you said you have my hose. Yeah. So let me just pack everything up for you. Got a couple of backpacks still right here, so. Correct me if I'm wrong, but everything in those backpacks is yours except for the hose, right? I don't know. I genuinely have no idea at this point. You want your warp stone? No. It's like a bed frame. I don't deserve one. Okay.
put the fix on there too? Yeah. None of them have anything in them. Oh no, that's the backpack I have on me right now. Yeah. How'd you get it where you could teleport two waypoints? I don't know why it lets me do that. Oh, no, you can. You can just do it. Yeah. That was the secret I kept from you. That is wild. It, it might actually be an operator power thing. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah? Yeah. In which case, we should check that. Re remove my operator powers real quickly, and I'll see if I can still do that. I don't know how I unoperate somebody actually. Hold on. And end users. Players. Okay, he took everything good. Dion. Alright, press B. Or press E. Go into your thing. Yep, that was an operator power. Oh. Which means that using it was kind of, though I didn't know it, an abuse of authority. So, no, it's, if you didn't, not, uh, ignorance of the law is not breaking the law. I, ignorance of the law, ignorance is pretty specifically not an excuse. <laughs> it... The consequences of accidentally abusing those operator powers is that all of my ill-gotten gains were confiscated by a recognized officer of the law. That's civil forfeiture for you. If that's how you want to frame it, I'm fine with that. Cool. <laughs> if you want, you can kill me again. Alright, I sentence you. The game restarting. Okay. If you accept these terms. Sure. Well, actually... At this point, I have nothing. I may as well throw my mercy on the goodwill of someone more powerful than me. So now I'm your slave. Or how about this? Step you, right on top of your butt. You can spare my you can spare my life in exchange for Step just right slavery. You're gonna knock me off, aren't you? Farewell. Okay. You imbecile! You couldn't even kill me right! Guess you just had a botched execution! Get back here now! Is that what you did? Did what? Did you just go to a random location and then set your spawn there? Yeah, that's how I was able to make sure nobody found me for the longest time. That is awesome. It Nobody else did that. I was kind of surprised nobody did. You know, because I was able to find... I found Jack very easily for a number well, of reasons. Also, if you go to the map... Jack's base takes up, like, fucking half of it. Well, to be fair, that's your map. The map isn't shared. It's stuff you've personally loaded in. The way I found Jack's is because he posted his, he posted his cords to the server. Uh. And I found Rihanna by... Well, she had a video showing the old house's cords. There was also... She posted a picture with cords that was not her base, but her base ended up being on 
a line between those coordinates and spawn. So I was able to find her that way. I found Corinne and Jack, the other Jack, by just flying around the starting continent. And very specifically, what I would do, and, you know, this is my method. I'm revealing my method now because the trick is over. It, I was able to kind of tell where people had already been by just paying attention to the speed of loading chunks. Because it was faster than it was loading them, if it was slower than it was actively generating them. So I was able That's to... Smart. I was able to use it to trail people. There, there are other ways to do that, but you would need to know the seed and have external software. And then beyond that... And I found you... Well, I actually did find you last time, but I managed to successfully trick you into thinking I hadn't. Because I saw your name I, briefly. I, mean, I figured you had... Well, I saw you got, you got so close to me, I was like, there's no way he doesn't well, know Well, specifically what happened is that I found your name on the map, and then I just turned in the opposite direction and told you that I hadn't found you. That was the trick I pulled. But in the end, it didn't matter, and the forces of good triumphed. So. So unfortunate. I mean, if you need slave labor. No, because right now I literally have nothing. The only thing I can do is try to throw myself on the mercy of someone more powerful than me. Would you like to work for your stuff back? Not for my stuff back, but I'm willing to work. To get your feet on the ground? That's hilarious. To do anything at all. For forgiveness. Not even my stuff back. Forgiveness. Nothing material whatsoever. I destroyed anything. I destroyed everything I have. Now I'm purely a... <laughs> a self-inflicted punishment. It's called... It's called penance! <laughs> I have nothing. All I can do is throw myself on the mercy of the only person who regularly logs on the server. The retribution is wild. Just give, give me some slave quarters or something. I'll take anything. I build you an outhouse. <laughs> build, build me a doghouse or something. I'll sleep in it. No, I'm not about to roleplay fucking... Owning slaves. <laughs> it's not. Then it's indentured servitude. That's just a funny word for slaves. But it's different. Indentured servants are Irish. Yeah, true. Indentured servants work for pota for potatoes. Please, just give give me something. Give me something to do for you. <laughs> I, I, I don't want you to do anything. And all I can do uh, is rot away and die. Don't make my don't make penance your life's mission. I'm I'm gonna I'm I'm gonna figure out a way to make I'm gonna become the server's first flagellant. There's no whip. I can't scourge myself. Come on. Are there rags? Is there sackcloth and ashes? Now he wants to play. I'm gonna become a beggar. But I am serious. That I didn't know that the teleport thing was an op power, and I made no, you're fine. extensive use of it. There was. Did you see the big obsidian meteorite? I didn't even know because I never really used those waypoints yeah. aside from like. Oh, I want to mark this down. Well, for later. I, I didn't I use them either. Kind of crazy. It is. It's really useful though, and now you know you can do that it. It's absurdly useful. Yeah. I have no food. I have nothing. All I have is abnormally high amounts of physical durability. Okay. Oh, make a request. Oh, there you are. Hi. I can't get up because I don't have any jump height. I can't break any of your blocks. I'm stuck. <laughs> stuck in this hole. 
Um. I hear hold up. I, I guess I'm just gonna live under under your farm. That's what my life is now. Here. It's it's Take a, this as an extension of my gratitude. A, I won this in battle. One dirt block. <laughs> right. One dirt block to get this out of the farm. Guy. I can't. I'm stuck now. I'm just stuck. Take this as an extension of my gratitude. I can't, but it's an ill-gotten gain, confiscated by an officer of the law. No, it's something that I won, and therefore I'm giving to you. Here. I, I can't. I can't. Thank you for breaking that law. Well, you passage. Well, I can't take the meat, but I'll accept this one piece of cobblestone. That's what I'll start with. One piece of cobblestone. Alright. Didn't you want food? Well, I can't accept it. It's something that you rightfully you took from me. Okay, well now I'm giving it to you on as as a, an extension of of of, of uh, feeding my slave. <laughs> I can't, I can't I can't accept it. It'd be too good for me. I don't deserve okay, it. Fine. I'm undeserving. Here, hold on. I actually have a fuck ton of pork chops if you want them. Well, now I've fallen. Mind. I've fallen in a hole. I can't escape. I'm gonna rot down here. That's all I can do. Just let me <laughs> let me fertilize your crops. <laughs> let my flesh fertilize your crops. <laughs> <laughs> Just have 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 enough mercy to drown. Have enough mercy to drown me or incinerate me instead of letting me slowly starve. What did you say? He runs around and shits on my farm. Just just give me give make me your garden hermit. Make me your garden hermit. Make me your garden hermit. Just build me a little hut! <laughs> Please! Here. Take this. I made that sp I made that new. Okay. Use this. Thanks. You just let me I gave you raw pork chops too, so I'm not that nice. Okay. I figured you'd appreciate that. It, did, that it didn't that it nice. didn't even give me food poisoning. Can you just pour a bucket of water down on me? Yeah, I got you. Okay. You sound so defeated! It's, it's so over. It's never been more over than this. Please. What did you say? Alright, bud. Here. Help. Help. Help me. Help me. Okay. What? What? <laughs> no! Help! <laughs> I didn't know you had a disposal shoot. <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. <laughs> what? What is happening to me? <laughs> I'm just gonna drown here now. <laughs> I can't believe I fell in the trash. Com can't we, I can't believe I found the trash compactor from Star Wars Episode Four: A New Hope. The hit siphon fantasy movie based on Akira Kurosawa's hidden fortress. The famous Jedi Geki period drama movie. <laughs> I'm not drowning myself on purpose. I'm drowning myself to talk about Star Wars. Oh. <laughs> The nice thing is that when I had those op powers, I could just teleport to my death gravestone. That was really, really nice. Well, uh, uh, okay. I don't, can I, I can't get the stuff from your grave. No, I need to give you that gravestone, the... The key? Yeah. If you, if you drop it down my chute, I'm, like, literally staring at your gravestone. Okay. Cool down five minutes. I'm gonna have to make an overland journey now. There you go. Walk on your bare feet like a man. Like a Pitho worm. Like a pathetic sniveling worm. 
It's true. Like you, you were like you just truly just fell down the chute and died. It, it, <laughs> That's so funny. I completely forgot I did that. What was that even for? What was the purpose of that? I went down to go mine more prosperity shards and diamonds, but mm -hmm. I didn't want to have to like go anywhere, so I just mined and straight down. I have a different hole now that I've been using. You, I, 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 I feel like there there's some symbolic resonance to that. You committed the Minecraft cardinal sin of digging straight down, and it was someone else who paid the consequences. Yeah. Well, I dig dug straight down on purpose. Uh, oh, I know. And I, I paid the consequences. Trillion hearts. Oh, so I'm surprised at how close your base is to Jax. Because I know you said I that... I was too. We did not plan that. I, oh, I didn't know where his base was when I made mine. I know. I know you said that, but I thought you were either lying to me or talking about the old house. Oh, no. No, like, I literally just was like, you know what? I want to set up a computer somewhere. I don't really want to have this spawn anymore. I want to make something a lot cooler, something more long-term. Um, and so I literally just set out on a journey. I just went in one random direction and, you know, went across the world. And I just so happened to... I, I was driving. Basically, my store is, like, I was, um... I got in the water, and I was sailing up, I was sailing north, and then I came across this cliffside, and I was like, and I knew it immediately, because I was like just searching for a place to, um, settle down. Yeah. And... How did you find me, anyway? Now that I'm neutralized. Are you neutralized, and you're not going to play evil anymore? How could I? All right. I mean, I don't. I mean, I love pranks, and like, I don't mind pranks at all. But like, don't you don't have to be a villain. We let's share stuff with each other and like play the game. Okay. All right. All right. And I hope you don't agree to that, just as a way to get on my good side after I tell you how I got to your base. All um, right. But in that case, it'd probably be better not to tell me and just use it as something to hold over my head. No, I, I, I'm nicer than that. And I can always, there will probably be another way at some point. Fair. But by the time you set up somewhere random, build a whole new base, and want to be that menacing, I'll probably have enough stuff to combat you anyways and prevent it from happening in the first place. That's fair. How I found your base, it was actually genius. What was um, it? I was really proud of myself. Was it triangulation? Yes. You opened your waypoint on stream. Your warp stone. Mm. You opened your warp stone on stream and it showed the distance from other waystones that you had visited. Yeah, I thought about never using those waystones again. Because of that specifically, but that's not something I can afford to do now. Or at least hi uh, that hiding my screen before I used a waystone. That was a vulnerability that I figured I had. But I didn't do enough to cover that up. So well, that's because, dude, how to long keep did... everything covered like that is ridiculous. But how long did you know where I was before you actually struck? I've known for like two weeks. Oh, okay. Interesting. So you were lying the entire time you said you didn't know where I was. That's smart. Yeah. Um... Actually, let me check. But I presume that you and Jack are the only people who are going to have operator powers for the foreseeable future now that we know that teleportation is what it oh, is. Oh, wait, no, I lied. That wasn't two weeks ago. That was one week ago. Yeah. I mean, in the end, that's the thing, is that the counterplay you have for someone... You know, that was my, my thing, you know, what kept it fair was always just... You could get hints from just watching me either live or after the fact... And you would know when I would be on, so you'd be able to counter that if you had any interest. You know, it's like a weather forecast. There's predictability to what I do and when I do it. Dude, Pi Sonat has 172,000 people watching his stream. Well, that's... That's insane. It's the Pareto Principle. Well, it's more of a power law type thing. But... 
generally speaking, any kind of competitive system is going to have almost all of the surplus monopolized by an incredibly small portion of competitors. It's how things work. But you, you know about the 80-20 rule, right? I've heard of it. Well, it's also known as the Pareto Principle. Well, it's not the only thing Pareto did, but it's one of them. And the idea was largely just... The, fa the idea that in any given system, 20% of the members, quote-unquote, are responsible for 80% of the effects or results. So, for example, it's... You know, 20% of the people with 80% of the money, or 20% 20, 20 of the workers doing 80% of the work, or anything like that. And it's it's an informal heuristic, but it's something that gets used in a lot of situations and is generally seen as holding somewhat true. That's the idea. Hmm. It It's something you hear about a lot in, you know, the kinds of people... Oh, did you take all my experience tanks? They should be in one of the backpacks, at least, or back in the system now. It's everything yeah, was put in one of the backpacks, so, so now it's just been organized into a central location, so I did that for you. <laughs> yeah, I was really proud. Now, experience tanks, I wouldn't mind being stolen. I mean, I wouldn't mind a little bit, it'd suck, but I, I could just go to that Enderman farm and obsessively grind experience out of the... Like, I'm level 90 right now. Yeah. And that... I don't really think I'll it could, it could be worth going to some Mars Nouveau stuff, then. Honestly. Because... The, there's so many levels to burn yeah, on spells. Yeah, so many levels to burn on spells. You've got a spell book, you've got... A scribing table. It, it's very, very useful. The big thing is that it's... It gives you the ability to have an infinite use netherite pickaxe, among other things, and the utility of that cannot be understated. Well, I'm effectively... I effectively have that already. Yeah, but at the very same time, it's... The fact that the spellbook is effectively a very useful multi-tool... No, I'm not going to deny how useful Ars Nouveau is. What I will say... Um... I'm not, I'm not going to deny how useful Ars Nouveau is. I just want to focus on other mods. That's fair. Just because I've spent a lot of time on this one. I think the other thing is that Ars Nouveau is a good sort of early and mid-game mod, especially in a pack like this. I wouldn't say it's really an end-game mod. There are things you can do to boost spell power, but that's more an Iron Spells and Spellbooks kind of thing. Mm. Yeah. I actually didn't know how those how those worked for a while. Oh well. Um, but yeah, that's how we that's how we got to your base. Um, that's cool. And I'm not gonna lie to you, I was I felt like it was Jack and I. Together. Oh, both of you had that. done that. Okay, cool. We 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 sort of worked together on that. Um, but I'm not gonna lie that I was so proud of doing that. I was like, I'm a fucking in just genius. Fair. Oh wait a minute, no, hold on. Alright. Um Are you gonna give me my Are you going to give me your key for your grave? Eh. Dude. Hardball is hardball. I've gotten the information I needed. <laughs> I 
I've gone through every single one of the stages of grief over the past hour. Every single one. I, I'd like to say I'm proud of that one, but that was more of a made up on the fly than a anything else really. It, the question is just how I'm going to get this thing open now. Now that I know how to keep myself secure. Are you still on the game? Yeah. It. Th this was a real epic saga. That's known. Hmm. But. Now that I know that it was a matter of triangulating from warp stones, and the crazy thing is, is that they would have had to be watching my VODs, which is really the craziest part. It. I'm impressed. I'm actually more than a little, more than a little flattered. Hmm. Well, it's an interesting idea. <sighs> Dealt a serious blow to a crucial adversary. Yeah, that's what I thought. I didn't think they'd ever look for me. It was interesting. But of course, I need to figure out a way to open this up now. This is the thing. It is what it is. <clears throat> and the big thing is, once I have a way to open this up, I have other plans and other ideas. I know where to hide. Get all my shit back. Well, sooner or later. Not sooner or later now. What do you want? I... I'd say I'd like to be able to take... Let's settle on a number of things that I can take for myself from storage. In addition to the things that I gave you. What? What do you mean? Well... To get myself back on my feet. Are you just using te random teleports? Yeah. It's the easiest way to do things. All you gotta do is put a single block of glass in front of... in front of that disk drive. And in front of your computer. And just break it every single time you use your storage. It's that simple, and nobody can take anything from you, period. It's all you have to do. Are you familiar with the philosophy of international relations realism? It states, no. it states that in an international system... <clears throat> where, among other things, <sighs> there are numerous actors competing for dominance, and there's no sort of international authority of enforcement to ensure that rules are followed. You can never ensure 
that anyone will not have the power to kill and otherwise destroy you. And therefore, you have to act as if everyone is always out to get you. You can never negotiate except from a position of power. Seems like a healthy way to live here. It like, certainly makes a number of things harder. Much. It's a very... It's not a risk-taking strategy. It's probably the most anti-risk-oriented strategy of them all. That's precisely why it ends up prevailing. <sighs> well, these melon slices sure are tasty. So, let's talk about getting my items back. What about it? What do I have to do in order to get my items back? Find me and steal them back. If you could find me the first time, I'm sure you can manage it again. I already told you how I did that. Yeah. And you also said that by the time that things got to endgame, you'd find another method for sure. Yeah, but... Dude... Hardball is hardball. Not when you're using a TP random feature. Alright, let's be real. There's no game. I didn't use TP random. What did you use then? You teleported somewhere random. Or you used a... That's as much information as I'm going to give you. You know, I'd like to be able to show what's going on right now, but he's watching.
be like that. Okay. And I think... Get on the server. I think that's an end to our little game of cat and mouse for today. Brennan, seriously, get on the server. It's Be a man. saying that I can't do it. It says no connection right now. You didn't get kicked. Yeah, I know. It still says no connection. Just refresh it. That's weird. I mean, you can go ahead and kill me. That gravestone's still going to have that stuff in it. At the time I'm on, I'm sure that you'll have killed me in my absence. And that you'll have changed the game rules to allow you to break other gravestones. It didn't change shit. It just allowed me to break your gravestone. Oh. Well, there you go. It's all back to zero now. Yep. Cool. Rats on playing hardball. I kind of figured that'd be what happened. There you go, you have all your stuff back. And the couple of melons that I had. Thank you, you're so kind. Yeah. Well, either way, I think that's the end of my involvement, at least for today. Probably for the okay. foreseeable future. We had some fun. You got your stuff back. My stuff, too. Goodbye.